So, that's a lot shall we begin? Yeah. So from yesterday, we learned a little something about the schools in Poland. Mm -hmm. So now we want to know something about the schools in Romania. Okay, so Are they any different from our schools? Like uh, the system? Yes, the system. Uh, I think it's uh, pretty much the same. Because we have a primary school mm -hmm. uh, in our school. Yeah? Uh, from classes um, where um, we have one primary uh, teacher, he's a primary teacher, yeah, he teaches from the first grade until the fifth grade, like here, only that we call, uh, the difference is we call from the zero class until the fourth class. So it's but a, it's the same. It's the same the system. Same. Yeah. The name is different. The name is different, but we still, uh, they still teach uh, like uh, five classes uh, in the primary school. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then uh, in the uh, secondary, low level, yeah. This is our secondary school. or gymnasium. Yeah. Uh, it's uh, like from the fifth class until the eighth class. Mm -hmm. And here it's the sixth until, Six the, until the ninth. The ninth. Yeah. So it's pretty much the same. And then they have uh, an exam, mm -hmm. uh, Romanian and maths, in the eighth grade, national exam. And they, uh, when, according to, to the grades, they, to high school. Yeah, but according to the grades they they have in this exam, they choose uh, a high school. They go to a high school. Mm -hmm. And what, how do how does the grading system work? As in, what's the best grade and what's the worst grade? So in primary, we don't have grades. Mm -hmm. We have uh, uh, quality Mar marks. A, B, C is in England, for example, and we have good, uh, very good, uh, sufficient, uh, insufficient, insufficient. Like this uh, for steps, yeah. Mm -hmm. Instead of no. Instead of marks, yeah. And since, since the fifth grade, we start uh, with uh, notes, with... Uh, uh, Number from one to ten. From one to ten. One to four, uh, don't uh, go in the other it's class. like not passing the, the, not the passing. class. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And from the five, five uh, until to the ten, ten it's uh, a normal grade. They, they graduate, they go in, in the next class. So ten, it's the uh, highest... Uh, Great. Can be the best in the classroom, for example, who has <coughs> 10. No. <coughs> so you have the same here? Um, no, here we have marks as in 1 is the best and okay. 5 is the worst. The like best. in Germany? Yes. Yeah. So in same German system, system is the same. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And in the Netherlands it's, it's different. Uh, uh, schools can choose if they rather work with A to E with A being the worst and E being the best, <coughs> but they can also decide to do from 1 to 10, and then 10 is the best and 1 is the worst. Mm -hmm. And for exams, in every school it's 1 to 10, because it's national, and they ha all have to grade it the same way. So in an exam year, you cannot give them A to E, but you have to give the students 1 to 10, mm -hmm. because of the exams. Just an exam in the exam year? Yeah, yeah, but because, well, you have to work with uh, grades from 1 to 10 in the previous year of exams okay. and the exam year, okay. because else uh, you cannot calculate an, uh, the so grades to okay. see if there are so class or not. two classes count for the... Uh, yeah, we, we start from the first, from our first class yeah. until our exam years, yeah. but some uh, schools work with A to E in previous years, and if they go to exams, then they will get grades from 1 to 10. So they have to switch yeah. during their career. So yeah. um, uh, what about the previous years when they... Uh, oh, primary marked, school. Uh, you mean the primary school? Yeah, where they had from A to E. Mm -hmm. Does uh, this count for uh, the final... No, there's, there's a follow-up system, uh, yeah. which is quite different. They're graded uh, on several subjects, and then they have an end test. And the end test has a score, and uh, via the score they can apply for a certain level on uh, secondary school. In what class do they have this final exam? The final exam is uh, in our uh, low level and mid level, 
it's in the fourth year okay. in uh, our well let's say uh, the, the level between the highest and the middle level they have exams in the fifth year in our school yeah. and the highest level has exams in their sixth year so they're about 18 years old because they start okay. at 12 in our school and they're 18 years old doing the exam in the highest class okay. So our students in our department are about 15 or 16 when they have an exam. And they have exams in eight uh, subjects. Okay. Yeah. In how many days do, do they have uh, this, uh, Two weeks. Two weeks. Yeah. Like um, uh, one uh, subject per day or? Sometimes twice per day. Twice per day. Yeah, it depends on uh, which subjects you choose. How many hours? Does last this uh, two or three hours for one, one exam. exam. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So they have uh, like uh, doing essays or how? Uh, what kind of exam is it? For uh, languages, they have texts and letters to write, and sometimes uh, something ABCD like an, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Choose sometimes the choosing right the, the right uh, answer. Yeah. Uh, and for my subject, for instance, for history. It's a combination of all kinds of questions. Okay. So open question, multiple choice question, also questions to put uh, uh, events in the correct historical order. So it's uh, very different from other subjects. This uh, <coughs> exams, this sub, um, are, are they national? This, yeah, uh, national. Okay. Yeah. So it's they good. all do the same exam. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so. Uh, <laughs> So you, you have to make the, the questions. Yeah. yeah, we were talking about. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, hello. So let's go away from school for now and yeah. let's talk more about people. Right. So what is the what is the like very common hobby in Poland and Romania? For example, here in the Czech Republic, it is very common most people to go into the forest and look for mushrooms and then then make food from it okay but w what about you this is an example or a really example, a fact. example. Uh, the most common hobby for uh, <laughs> students or exactly for, for anyone for anyone a very common hobby. to play on the computer, computer yeah. or a <laughs> tablet <laughs> or on the phone <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is a yeah. national <laughs> hobby. <laughs> yeah. yeah, playing on computers. So. Yeah, also in the Netherlands. Games. Games. Yeah, too much. We have problem much with uh, the classroom because uh, uh, they like to <coughs> to move something very quick in front of their eyes, and a teacher can't uh, run in the classroom to present. We present them present them with the aid of the video projector and uh, they are good they listen they watch they but quiet. if they want and quiet, <laughs> but if you want to talk to them it's very difficult they <laughs> they they haven't patience no. they can't stay no. and watch a, a, a teacher speaking with them but if you project them on they are good. Yeah. They like it a lot. Yeah, it's very similar here. It's yeah. pretty much the same. You yeah. have the, the same hobby. <laughs> yes, same hobby, playing video. Are, are you right? allowed to bring yeah. them in schools? What? Are you allowed to take them? Well, no. But? No one's listening to the teachers. Well, I, I'm not really the guy to be questioned is I don't take my phone to school. Okay. If you want to question, you have to <laughs> ask that him. <laughs> yeah, it's, you can't have your phone uh, in a lesson. Mm -hmm. You can have it on, you must have it off. Mm -hmm. In the school they go away. In school, or, and you must have it in bag. In bag. Oh, okay. yeah. And you must turn it off, but not everybody will... Listen to it. Yeah. What about during the breaks? Two, it's two. You must have it again in your bag, mm -hmm. but okay. not everybody. Else. And what happens if somebody breaks uh, the phone? <laughs> <laughs> what happens? <laughs> so it's for teachers, because some teachers take your phone, uh -huh. and your parents uh, must go to school for it. Uh -huh. 
and or some because teacher so accepted. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's the same. Yeah. <coughs> That's the same yeah. in the Netherlands. We also have the rule, don't use your phone in class, but some teachers take it away immediately and some say, okay, put it back and then it's fine. But we also use it for part of the lesson. Yeah, yeah, yeah to yeah. do things with assignments yeah. with or something on the projector and then you can log in on your mobile and so they can cheat easily no they can't cheat but uh yeah, for instance if i put an online questionnaire mm -hmm. on my uh, projector then they can play with it yeah. so they can put their answers in, in their mobile phone and then see their results yeah yeah, yeah we also have like if you, for example, during math, don't have a calculator with you, you can follow your phone. Okay, then right? you can use it. <laughs> she allows, she uh, Also she depends on the teacher, yeah. maybe? Yeah. Okay. On the level of schooling, maybe. Yeah. So, um, I ran out of questions. <laughs> Should I ask you? Yes. Okay. What's your favorite subject? Well... I don't, well, mm, <laughs> we won't mm, tell you, you don't <laughs> have one. <laughs> I don't have one, but PE is defi definitely very fun. Yeah. Because. <laughs> you told me yesterday. Yeah. Because? <laughs> because we make fun of everything. We absolutely do not, do not care what is happening or what we are so forced you don't, to do. So you don't do sports in, in the Yeah, we, we play like games like basketball, football, but we just. No rules. No, 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 not no, no yeah. rules. Well, how many classes per week? How many classes of PE per week do you have? Uh, we have two, two on Wednesday, right after each other, right one after each other. Two. Just two? Yeah. The whole two. week. The whole week. Mm -hmm. Only on Wednesday. We have one hour class Yeah, we have two or one. No, three. No. Okay. What about you? Um, it depends on, on the class. Mm -hmm. uh, the first class or second class have more PE than exam years or pre-exam years. Which means what? Three? Four? No, do, do you know that, uh, Ingrid, or sorry? sorry. How, how many hours in per week does a class have PE in our school? One hour now. But One also for the first 60 classes? Yeah, 60 minutes. Really? Yeah. Oh, because our first and second classes have two hours. So 120 minutes. Yeah, because they first class to play class mm -hmm. uh, chief, uh, chief, like your first your class. Your first class is like uh, um, what for you it would be for for here it would be eight, no seventh or eighth grade, and yeah. for you it would be sixth or seventh grade. Okay. Yeah. So how old are? So you? about the ages from from twelve. Thirteen. Thirteen. Yeah. 13. yeah. Yeah, they have two hours a week in our department, maybe in other departments they have only one hour, also yeah. for per day, okay. And then uh, second class also two hours, and then in the third and fourth class, so they would be uh, 15, 16 years old, just one hour. Yes, so. Yeah. What are your expectations from this project, keep fit and be healthy? Well, to be honest, I don't really know much about this project. But Think about the title, Keep Fit and Be Healthy. What would it suggest to you? <coughs> what would you like to do if you were involved, chosen to take part? Mm. I don't really know. <coughs> would you like to visit another country? Yes, yeah, definitely. Okay. It's just... If you were invited to come to Romania, you would have to dance with me. <laughs> oh, it's, it's, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, so I have to fake an injury if I don't want to. <laughs> you, you, you shouldn't, you're not allowed. Uh, we have a beautiful nurse. Yeah. Oh, really? Yes. Oh. <laughs> you will be saved instantly. Ah. <laughs> okay. So, um, I think I remember what you teach. Okay. Surprise me then. <laughs> <laughs> she geography. said, I think. Yes, geography. And history. Yes, very good. Yeah. But I don't know about the others. I teach English back in Romania. English. Mm -hmm. and I teach at a primary school. Mm -hmm. Class yeah. uh, form from 1 uh, and 0 to 4. Mm -hmm. 6 and to 10 years old. Uh, uh, here is uh, from 1 to 5. Mm -hmm. 
But it's the same, the name I told you is the same. <coughs> and what, what subject do you teach? All. All the All. subjects. Like uh, here, the, like we uh, have one teacher for primary school. Even English and uh, uh, math and uh, Romanian and Sometimes history karate. and geography <laughs> and Judo. maybe Judo? sport. Yes, I, <laughs> I'm a coach. Uh, I teach a lot of people uh, Judo and uh, Karate. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And now uh, I'm uh, associate uh, with a friend. Uh, he is a uh, coach for, for uh, Aikido. And together try to have a good, uh, uh, what's his name? A good club, uh, good, uh, a good job. Mm -hmm. Maybe we go with uh, that uh, sports people so, uh, with, uh, in a compact. You know, complete, but in time we are at the start now. Mm -hmm. yes. I uh, teach uh, sport and uh, like a, a coach uh, more than 20 years ago, and was some problem. And uh, for a long time, I didn't uh, went uh, in uh, in a sport, uh, room, uh, sport. Uh, Gym. Gym, așa. Uh, and uh, now uh, uh, one of my students told me, please come and let's uh, start again. And now I'm there. Okay. 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 So I'm teaching uh, civics. I don't know if you have here. So social studies. Social studies. Well, we kind of have something similar, but. No, not really. Huh? Yeah, but... Like citizenship or something like this? No, we don't really have something like that here. Okay, I'm also teaching uh, ICT, a computer. Yeah, in mm -hmm. Okay. I'm teaching in, in um, secondary school, lower school, secondary school. Yes, okay. Well, it's that time again. I ran out of questions. <laughs> okay. so, is this your first interview? Yes, it is. Okay. Oh, you Wait, do you like well. chess? Yes. Chess? Chess, yes. Okay. Uh, with the king, the queen. Oh, uh, I like chess, but chess. unfortunately, we are supposed to end. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you or chess? No. <laughs> Both. Both, okay. Congratulations for your first yeah, interview.